San Ramon Valley firefighters had to use a kayak to help this mom and her three-year-old and six-month-old get out of their house. I really felt at no time we weren't going to be rescued, but it still was very traumatic. Okay. Debbie Zentner's daughter just moved to Danville earlier this year. She came to pick up the family and will take them to her house. Was he scared or anything? No, he loves the fire trucks. Okay. A little adventure for him. It's an adventure for all of us. Okay. Mommy's here, baby. Here comes Daddy. Nelson Brostrom says their garage already has flooding. He's just glad he and his family got out when they did. This is not the Saturday you were expecting. This is not what we were expecting whatsoever. We, uh, I started cleaning out the drains early this morning, like uh, multiple hours ago, and um, thought I was making a difference for a little bit, and then all of a sudden just too much water is coming down. Fire officials say several blocks of this Danville neighborhood are impacted in the areas of El Capitan and Iron Horse Trail. John Beans took video of this SUV floating across the street. There's a Ford excursion one block there that's up above its axles in the water, and I saw it come floating down a street to a stop. So even with a Ford excursion, you're not getting out of this. Fire officials say this is not typical for Danville. Battalion Chief Eric Falkenstrom says there was just too much water for the drainage system to handle. Any and all creeks right now are over flooded, and so what's normally a small creek has turned into this.